All right, guys. So uh, I was here earlier this morning. Me and Daniel did a little thing on uh, Grand Theft Auto, but uh, I missed this this morning. This is uh, crazy to me. Uh, Valheim, the Viking survival game uh, that's been hot this month, uh, has sold over 4 million copies now. Uh, in the first week, it was like a million. Uh, then it went up to 2 million, 3 million. And uh, it hasn't even, I think it's been, t it's been just over three weeks. It's been like three weeks in a day. And uh, they've sold 4 million copies. So they posted this on their Steam under uh, news. I'm just going to read through this real fast because this is insane. Look, I've played Valheim. I think I have about 35 hours into it now. Uh, I have a private server with some friends. Um, I love the game. Uh, me and my buddies love it. We're having a damn good time. Uh, and it doesn't really have any business being as good as it is. It's <laughs> no, it's it's not like it's it's really anything special. Uh, I think it's you know it's a it's a pretty uh, generic survival experience. Uh, but they do have some cool stuff in there. You know they have the Viking lore. Uh, the uh, the world is uh, is expansive. It's huge. And uh, but I mean the crafting, pretty straightforward stuff. I mean um, you know you start off with wood and then. You work your way up, and then you get stone crafting and crafting weapons, armor. I mean, it, it, it follows the uh, the survival template. And if you guys are familiar with my work uh, on the website at all, you'll know that I'm a huge survival genre buff. Um, I can't explain my own passion for it. I, I don't know. <laughs> when I say it out loud, it sounds silly. Like, what'd you do? Oh, well, I went hunting. had to kill a couple deer so I could eat. So then I could go have energy to do other stuff and build and so when I say it out loud it sounds silly but uh but so but I'm just saying before I I get into this I like Valheim I, I, I'm having a great time with it um but it, this is just insane to me this is crazy and not only is it a survival game but it's an independent game um which blows my mind so this is what they said uh this morning about passing four million um so they said Vikings, uh, when Valheim first hit Steam Early Access just three weeks ago, uh, we hope that all the hard wor work our small team put into the game these past three years would get the attention it deserved. Little do we know just how much Valheim would resonate with all four million of you. That's right, three weeks into Early Access, we've hit another milestone. Four million brave souls embarking on the most dangerous feat uh, in over a thousand years of Viking history, trying to make Odin proud. Now, this is what blows my mind, right? Not only is it uh, a survival game, uh, which by, the survival community is like, they're very tight. I, I know several people who I've played across several different survival games with. Uh, there's, there's a dense community, um, but this is insane. So these are some of the latest. So this past weekend, they hit 500,000 concurrent players. This puts Valheim in the top five most played games in the history of Steam. Three weeks. Three weeks. Valheim has put up 500,000 concurrent players. Of the 4 million uh, copies they've sold, they've had 500,000 people online at the same time. <sighs> That's insane. Top five most, plays game, most played games in history of Steam. And look at all the games on Steam. You have you have free titles like Warframe, you have DC Universe Online, um, all these free games. And then they have stuff you know like Rust that uh, picked up all that Steam. There's stuff like Daisy. Um, there's a lot of like big uh, MMOs, and so this is crazy. Um, Valheim has already been played for a combined total of ten thousand years. Uh, that's <laughs> 3,649,980 more days uh, than the 20 days it's been on Steam Early Access. It's still climbing the Steam's top 250 best-reviewed games of all time. It's currently in the 57th place and it has an 81,000 overwhelmingly positive reviews. Uh, 
talk about some flex, right? Like that's that is insane. Uh, for the fourth and surely not final time, thank you. We couldn't have wished for a more engaged, passionate, and supportive community. That's that's the survival, guys. I, that's I've ex I've seen it a lot, especially uh, over the last like five six years that uh, I've been online uh, playing through a variety of different survival games. So there's a lot of carryover, a lot of uh, you know people sticking together through games, uh, and they bounce back and forth between um, different ones. Um, so thank you for the community. All of uh, your amazing creations and ideas are keeping us motivated to deliver the Valheim you all deserve. So uh, this is early access. This is an early access, independent survival game that you can pick up for 20 bucks. All of those factored into me picking it up. And, I, and since then, I've picked it up for uh, three friends. Because, I mean, that's the price of a game right there. Like a full uh, AAA title game. There's 60 bucks, 20 bucks for me. So it's a little over. But it's, it's like I essentially bought one game, maybe a, a game in a DLC. But instead, I got a game for me and three friends. And then we've had, how many of us are on the server? Seven. So, so and then two other, two other buddies. Uh, they picked it up, so it's insane. It is really crazy, and anybody who is uh, familiar with the website knows that I have a magazine called the Indie Gamer Magazine, and this has been a huge topic. Um, this is kind of my, this is like all my wheelhouses put together. This is, this is survival genre. Uh, this is independent um, PC. This is just this is everything that <laughs> like I, I I focus on. It's insane. And I've been keeping up with it. I check back at the news every day. I've reached out to them um, for the magazine. And so I'm hoping to hear back from the, the Iron Gate team um, because this is just insanity. Like I remember a couple months ago, all the talk was about cyberpunk and, uh, Who's talking about cyberpunk still? <laughs> Everybody's talking about Valheim. This is crazy. Um, I've kind of known about this before it launched. I was looking forward to it. Uh, again, that community aspect, everybody was talking about it. And uh, never did I think uh, that this was going to explode like it has, which th this definitely means that there has to be a lot of new players to the genre uh, or people who... who um, you know, saw the twenty dollar price tag and thought, "What the hell?" You know, Vikings, twenty bucks. Um, so this is interesting. I wonder uh, the the rate of like new players to the to the genre and who's gonna play Valheim and be like, "Wow, I really love this." Uh, I wonder what else is out there. And then you see Ark, Seven Days to Die. You see Conan Exile. You see uh, all these other games. I wonder if they'll pick up a little bit of uh, a little bit of extra support after this, but. Yeah, ne never did I expect uh, something like this. And I say something like this like it's a bad thing. No, I, I mean something like this, like a small independent game that, that I kind of knew because I'm in this, this wheelhouse. And then see, just seeing it can explode. Um, it's really cool. Uh, congratulations to, to the team at Iron Gate. Um, it's, a, it's a beautiful game. Uh, I know some people are see the the low poly graph. It's supposed to look like that, but what's interesting is all the models and everything. Excuse me, all the models and everything are low poly, but the world, man, the the world is beautiful. Um, I have a whole folder <laughs> of screenshots and and amazing stills and everything that I took, and uh, it, it can be breathtaking. You know, it's it's been a ton of fun, and like I said, it's still in early access, so we can only expect better things. Um, I know for me, uh, being a fan of this of this type of game, um, the building and everything could obviously use some more work. Um, maybe the combat could use uh, a little polish, but for early access, this feel, like this could be put out as a finished game, 
and I don't think there'd be too much pushback. Um, I think there are little things, little polishes and stuff, but this is from a very small team of people who have been working and dedicating three years of their life to it. This is well-deserved, uh, so congratulations to that team. Uh, with all the success, I hope, you know, they, they're able to um, do everything they want to do with it, and then more, you know. I'm excited to see um, what else we'll see from Iron Gate. Um, looking at their Steam catalog, this is this has been all they have. So, I think a lot of great things are are in store for for Iron Gate. Look forward to seeing what they do with it. Look forward to seeing what uh, what all of these uh, four million people can look forward to in the game. Uh, I see a lot of great things coming for for this. So, I just wanted to give a little update. I know we put out something earlier today already, um, but I saw this and I was just blown away figured this would be you know kind of a perfect little clip to do so Valheim, check it out 20 bucks um i'll talk to you guys tomorrow